Hello! Martial arts are remarkable. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Sorry for the delay. Oh, uh, so we are back. Uh, we're close to level 50. So there's a couple things we want to do today. First things first, got to go to Prisma Valley. There's some quests we haven't done here. So let's finish up the side quest in Annika, which should not take too long. Uh, we have a couple things we, we have to do in Annika, actually. Annika is a pain in the ass uh, <laughs> hidden story. I was doing some of the hidden stories last night. And this one right here, I decided not to do because it requires me to go into a dungeon I haven't done on stream yet. And so I don't know if there's going to be plot stuff that is uh, only only happens the first time you go in a dungeon, as happens sometimes with dungeons in this game. So I thought the first time I do that dungeon, I should do it on stream. Uh, and then we have some quests here. Let's see, have we gotten all? Oh yeah, I beat this boss, Chuo. Uh, if I recall correctly, I think Chuo was quite tough. Something strange is going on in Prisma Valley. Rainless lightning struck. You jerk. You jerk. Man. I did some PvP last night. And I got so tilted. You have no idea how bad I am at PvP. Oh my god, I'm so bad at it. It's frustrating. Uh, still haven't gotten a win. I, I think I probably need to rebuild my character, but I also need to stop playing so stupidly because I'm so freaking aggressive that I'm just, I'm just an idiot. <laughs> Something strange is going on in Prisma Valley. Rainless lightning struck, followed by the faint screams of fiends. Way's home is nearby. I'm worried about his safety. Ooh, Way. Uh, ooh, there's a, oh, it's a roster quest. Cool. It's an instance. Let's head over here. There's another quest I see. Who cares about those guys? Um, I thought about uh, canceling stream today for various reasons because there's stuff I have to do, but I figured we're so close to 50 and it would be nice to unlock that stuff. So I, I think I, uh, yeah, I want to do a little bit of a stream today and hopefully hit that goal. Hello. You just wandered into Prisma Valley, haven't you? I saw you from afar. I wonder if Destiny had a hand in our meeting. Let's find out. Why don't you try to lift and move that stone dokibi? What is this thing? Hmm... I'm glad I could help. These are both roster quests. Ah, you moved the stone dokebi, which proves you have the makings of a master. How would you like to train in Prisma Valley to become a master of the arts? Uh, sure. It's weird that these are roster quests, meaning you do them once, you never do them again. That means that if you beat all those quests on one character, are there no quests in Prisma Valley ever again for other characters? That's super weird. This area had some of the dumbest Makokos. Like, let me show you this shit. Let's try to find some of these Makokos. Oh, you see a Makoko over here. How do you get to it? Do you jump? No. You freaking just walk over the clouds. What in the world? There's so much uh, nonsense with Makoko collection. <laughs> it's crazy. Okay, what do we have going on here? Is our dispatch... Our dispatch is not done. I don't care about the crafting. It's fine. Actually... I do care about the crafting. One second. Because we're trying to raise our stronghold level as much as we can, as soon as we can. We need to get to 15 to unlock the next tier of a bunch of stuff. And that's pretty far away. So. Let's. Oh, we can't proceed with research, can You're we? Back. I was waiting oh. for you. There are matters that need your approval. Sure. You can go check them in the office. Let's do that. Accept all. Hell yep. Okay, I think we're level 13. So we need to get to 15. Crafting. We can make six... That will put us, like, out of energy, right? 
Oh no, we need to rest. Action energy is all gone. No worries. I'm just gonna keep those going. Those seem we to be the, the most uh, cost efficient. Uh, I don't know if cost efficient is right, but they give a lot of XP. Um, I, I haven't seen how much they give compared to the, I mean, X, yeah, XP compared to the energy they use. Woo. Okay. I'm gonna need to cut down this place soon. Now, let's head back. I think I'm going to focus on logging for a bit. Solely because I, I think I need to have a bunch of uh, timber for all this crafting I'm going to be doing. Successor. Oh, this is the successor to Sidereal Shan. Interesting. I didn't... I, I saw that the dude called him a, uh, a uh, Sidereal. Oh, these dudes are creepers. Hey, guys. Oh, I gotta kill you too, don't I? I hate when I miss. Well, I, I guess that did hit them, even though it was in the wrong direction. I thought I heard Dojo's voice. So many have gathered here. Come at me, and don't hold back! There we go. Hey, Wei, what's up? Damn it, of course, just like Armin, he gets the last hit. I'm sorry. It all happened because I am weak in my left arm. Is the demon that hurled the world into chaos. Mm. The one who killed my master. Hey there, Zulu. Demon. Docho. Destiny has joined our two paths. <sighs> Thank you for stopping those fiends. I sense a rare and special power in you. The shrines, you say. I am the only one who can control them. But I'm still capable of such a feat? Yes. I can do it if you help me. What you just saw was Dochol the Immortal, a fiend that once brought chaos to the world. One of my ancestors trapped Dochol and saved the realm, and I have inherited this ancestral power. However, I have not been skilled enough to control the power. That's why I've locked myself up here. Perhaps you're strong enough to augment my limited skills. Before you head out to the shrines, could you help me to properly contain Dochol? Thank you. You're a true hero. Let's travel to the ritual site. You're a bit dead. Dochul is Hope you get some rest. Spirit handed down to each generation of the heirs of Sua. Excuse me. You can die. Oh, he can make a tornado. I can be a tornado. Yeah, yeah, do your dramatic shit. No one's there. I failed my family and I was not worthy of Dojo. In shame, I secluded myself. He dead. Way is sure grunting a lot, man. Are you finally ready? 
ready to be consumed. Do not speak in my master's voice! <laughs> it's all your fault because you couldn't control me. Your master died. Yes, master tried to protect me. That's why I must finish what he started and defeat you! Now! Move! I hate how I get hung up on him sometimes. Oh well. Accepted your fate. Now, mm. go forth into the wider world. Fight against evil and find the light. That is the path for you and the world. It's weird that this is a roster quest. This is a cool quest. I'd do this again. Okay, talked away. Thanks to you, my succession has been completed safely. Now that I have full control over my left arm, I'm going to work and help save the world, like my teacher did. Thyrain? Ah, I see. That descendant of Lutera is gathering people. If we have the same goal, perhaps we'll cross paths again sometime. Where are you going now? Another continent to find an ark. I have a feeling that we'll meet again. Until then, good luck. Okay. What do we get? What do we get? Who cares? Uh, sure, I'll use all of these. I'll use all those water wheels. Our stronghold can have just all the water wheels ever. It's amazing. Uh, anything else here? Oh, there's some new quests down there. Hmm. I wonder where that chaotic Chuo guy spawns. And what zone is that guy in? I think he only spawns like once a day. As far as I can tell. The big old raid. Let me see something. Chuo is 2 p.m. Huh. Or not? Are people doing Chaotic Chuo now? Where, where does he spawn again? Where does he spawn? I think he's there, right? Let's go there and check. He's there. Hell yeah. We're going to die, but let's let's just get a hidden. <laughs> Run away. That shit one shots you, I think. This guy's got so much health. Holy shit. I should probably get out of there, right? This guy's crazy, holy. Oh, one shot. What in the fuck? I mean, we're so close. Let's just do it. 
How the hell? Oh, all items went down by 5%. Oh, well. This guy's pretty freaking dangerous. Oh, fuck! One shot again! I don't think we lose our items if they break, but I'm not sure. I guess this could be a real bad stream, depending on what happens. God, dude, dude, stop. Don't get hit by those guys, I guess. Ow. Back away. Okay. It says block. Are we, am I doing like no damage to this guy? Get up close. Why is it saying block? Am I doing no damage? You need to be at least... Oh, 380 gear score. Oh, so I literally can't hurt this guy. And there's a countdown until he goes berserk. This is kind of... Oh, hey, Rezos. Hey there. Hmm. Does it say that gear score anywhere? Well, I guess there's no point in doing this. Uh, Twilight Mists. Let's check that out. Uh, where, where were our quests? Oh, wait. It was Prisma Valley. <laughs> Excuse me. So does Chaotic Chuo spawn at like 1 p.m. every day? That, that seems like it would uh, be awkward for a lot of people's schedules. Uh, oh, also, is there a repair person close? Uh, there is. Repair. Repair all. Okay. Oh, you're a visitor here. What brings you? Say, if you're not busy, how'd you like to dump out that leaf bag for me? I overturn the bag so many times a day that I feel like I'm being punished, along with Hodon. <laughs> this is also a roster quest. Are all their quests here roster quests? Chaotic duo. This dude right here. Okay, that was the 19th time. Just 10 more times for the day. You can't leave until you're done. Let's see. I'm thinking about what to make him uh, do after he's done sweeping. How about polishing each and every pebble on the temple grounds? <laughs> what a weird roster quest. Like, they're like, you can only do this once. And what you'll do is you'll turn over a bag of leaves. Does it add anything to the story? No. <laughs> It's like such a, <laughs> I, like I, I don't understand. I'm cool with it. I really miss food from the outside world. If I could have, uh, if I could have just one bite of proper food, I'm tired of pine leaves and dew. Hold on, who's being punished over there? As uh, hold on, who's being punished over there? Has a packed lunch in his bag. Please, I beg of you. Let me at least smell that food. Ooh, this is this guy's a rapport guy.
Why, why do you not need a gear score? It was doing, uh, it was just saying blocked to all attack. It pops up saying that? Spicy smelling stir fried beef. A perfect combination of peppers and bean sprouts. Is this liquor I'm smelling? I'm sorry to do this to hold on, but I have to taste these. I can't stop drooling. You need a... Oh, then yeah, you need a bit high score. I can't stop drooling. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm. it says... People said 380. I'm at 227. I'm a ways away. <laughs> Those who let their minds wander during training often get stuck in the form of whatever animal they have taken. Use a bamboo broom to help those who haven't returned to their original form. You have a strong build. I want you to help my students practice their spells. They've never used their spells on people before, so be prepared. Yeah, let's get off. Hey, what's up? Let's begin. Let's begin. I want to broom you. <laughs> what? Okay, I guess we're going over here. For that one. Okay, hello. Amazing. I'll help this guy too, because why not? There we go. <laughs> when you start thinking you might be stuck in animal form forever, you just need a reality check. Just, just try again. And you should be able to do better next time. Thank you for helping my students. My students might have been overly enthusiastic. You couldn't have stood your ground if it weren't for that strong build. I hope it was a good lesson for you. Hey, I have a question for you, by the way. The, uh... Tournament Champion's Plate. That you get for beating the tournament in Annika. Can you exchange that for anything? Okay, I think we're done here. Which is the map? Let's see. Which is the map that has Geox Barrier? There it is. We haven't done this. Has no purpose to your knowledge. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll hang on to it. I'll look it up on Google sometime just to see. Oh, hey, ghost. I don't think I can do anything with you right now. Yeah, I've used all my stuff. Oh, well. Okay, Jux Barrier. I think there's a hidden story here somewhere, too. Okay, how big is this place? This place looks like it's medium sized. You purposely put your headphones on to listen because you knew that yeah, I would say I have a question at some point.
Hey guys. Excuse me. I don't ah you fuck it, I'll use it. Who cares? Who cares? I didn't need to, but fuck it. Ooh, there's a Makoko. I'm not gonna worry about Makokos too much right now as uh I will come back here later to get all the Makokos and get the hidden story and do this on hard. As is the case with every dungeon. Ow. Excuse me, guys. Thank you. Sort of endurance. I'll take that. Hmm. Let's see. You know what? You know what's so uh, so weird that I just realized yesterday was um when you right click an engraving to equip it, it won't equip any of them into the second slot. It will just do it into the first slot, right? Oh, I see. Alt alt right click equips in the second slot because I just dragged it manually. So right click is first slot. Alt right click is second slot. So for a long time, it's just been running with one engraving. Okay. It's down here. Hmm. Coco. Man, there are just some ridiculous Makokos in this game. It is absurd. I uh, like I like I like the idea of Makokos, but I hate it when there's just like an invisible bridge going over an expanse that you're just like you just have to walk there. There's an invisible bridge. Like why? It seems like there'd be something here. No. There's probably a Makoko down here. Whatever. It's fine. That's your favorite thing? Uh, I, I like a lot of them, but the ones that it's like, oh, you're walking through a solid wall. You're walking through a solid wall, and now you're in a maze of blackness. It's like, what? Because it means you're playing the game like this. Like... Grinding against walls. Hey, guys. Hey, dudes. What's up? Hey, buddies. Excuse me. In the world is this? Hey guys. Hello. Hello. Gather up. Gather up. Oh, I hate the archers. There we go. I'll take that. Coco, wake me up before Makoko. I need to, at some point, I need to stop back off at Tortwick. You hate that Makokos have conditions to open in dungeons? Yeah, some of them are ridiculous. Um, I also don't like, the other thing I don't like is that you'll go to a dungeon. You'll go to a dungeon that is... The first time you do it, it's not, it doesn't count as a dungeon. It's just like a, an instance. So the Makokos are not on the map, like Brilliant Ridge, I think it's called. Like you go through the dungeon the first time and you can't get the Makokos, but then you have to go back and do it again. And then you can get the Makokos.
One where you uh, the let the ritual take place, pass it, kill everything, backtrack, kill everything on the way, then it opens. You know which one I hated? I hated the one that was kill all the slimes and bats in uh, the, like, Perkona's Seashore. Because partway through, there's an area you can't backtrack anymore. So you have to make sure you get it before you go there. Oh, I got petrified. Well. Yeah, the Krakona Seashore one was annoying. Like, the the one with the... What was it called? Uh, the Blackshore... The Blackshore Basement one, if you don't know what you're doing, is annoying. The moment you know how to do it, it's easy. Come on, guys. Come on, get closer. Oh, my God. Come on, dude. Here we go. Yeah, because the thing, the two things I saw when people said Medric, I mean, not Medric, I keep saying Medric Monastery, uh, Black Rose Basement, was one people were like, oh, the guys are red. Like, what are you talking about? When you highlight your mouse over all of them, they're red. The other thing it said is they don't aggro you if you don't attack. It's like, no, they do aggro you as long if they don't aggro you if you keep a distance. So what you start realizing is, oh, it's the, mostly guys without hoods, although there are a few guys with hoods, and just keep your distance and they won't aggro, and then you're fine. Ooh, hey guys. How tough are you? Hmm. I don't particularly want to use my good thing at this point. There we go. Okay. And there we go. Are you in a dungeon where you have to kill every single bat and slime in every nook and cranny? Yeah. Yes. That, I was just talking about that one. That is the most annoying one in my opinion that I've seen. Uh, in Krakonis Seashore. If you miss one mob... Yeah, because the thing that's annoying is as branching paths... But the dudes wander. So if you go to clear it one path, a dude might wander to the, be the beginning of the level. And there's the point where you go across a jump on like a bridge or something or like a zip line, and you cannot return. So if you miss something in the first half of the level, well, you just got to do the dungeon over again. And it takes freaking forever. You need to do that one? I did that one, but I think the way to do that one, honestly, I think the w I did it solo. And it took a couple attempts and it was annoying and it took way too long. I think the way to do that one is not solo. And what you do is you get one person to wait at every bottleneck so the fucking bats don't pass and the other person clears out. You you kind of do like a breach and clear like you're playing a SWAT game. Because it's so easy to miss them. What the hell are these dudes? Fuck it. Yeah, I, what I think we should do, honestly, is I think we should get, like, you, me, Simon, and Goats. So we have, like, four people. Because the reality is, if I do it with you, then I'm going to have to do it again with Simon. If I do it with Simon, I'm going to do it again with the Goats. I'm like, let's just get all of us to do it at one time. Because I, I don't I don't want to keep grinding out that dungeon over and over and over. I'm sure Simon's already at that point. Goats is probably a couple days away from it. But yeah, I would totally be down to do that. We found traces of the Ark. Soldiers of the Plague Legion. Follow them down to hell. Take the Ark for a con. 
It is interesting how some dungeons, like the Makokos are so much easier to find. Like I haven't really been trying very hard. I mean, I'm sure I missed one right. Where was it? Right here? Was that it? There's a part where you could, I I'm sure there was one here. But it's funny, some dungeons, like, you don't try and they're all just out in the open. And other dungeons, it's like, where the fuck are these? They also so often, like, hide them in a bush so you can't see them. I'm going to switch to guild chat. I don't like getting surrounded, but whatever. That skill's not very good. I should replace that one. I should really replace that skill. Like, my one skill's at 10, and it's noticeably weaker than my other skills. There we go. <laughs> Big follows. Oh, poison. Delightful. I love how that hit hits guys behind you. That skill is not as good as I would like. I think I'm going to replace that at some point. Oh, god damn it. Get out of there! Shit. <laughs> uh, anything I missed over here? Not that I see. Not that I see. All oh, these ghosts. These dang old ghosts. Okay. Let's just get everyone to spawn. Okay. There we go. They're dead. Where I, I I should probably look to see if I find the hidden story here. If I find the hidden story, I will try to get the other piece to it. Because it's on the timer. But otherwise. Defeat the demons in the covetous legion. Yeah, yeah, come on, guys. Come on, dudes. You guys are laughing like a Care Bears villain. Well, that was a fail. Okay. Hey, what's up? Witch of Desire. Oh, we gotta kill one more demon somewhere. Hey! Nice of you to show up! There you go. 
finally found you. Hammer bro. You possess the Ark of Lutera. What are you waiting for? Tear that fool to pieces and take the Ark. Ooh, we're fighting a spooky match ham. Okay, excuse me. Excuse me. Yeah, do your shit. Do a big AOE move, probably, maybe. Whoop! How, how long is this gonna go? There you go. Oh, I'm getting hit. Who cares? I want, I want, I... I prioritize damage over uh, defense there. I was like, ah, I'm doing my good move. Dodge! Damn it. Couldn't jump out of that with the way of that. He did. This isn't over. Phase two? As long as you have the arc, the Plague Legion will find you and take Amazing. I'll take that. Okay, is there a hidden story somewhere? I looked at the map at one point, and there was like a hidden story up near the top, I think. Oh. How, how long? We have a half an hour. The Sidereal's two students. Warn Diary. The Master's condition is getting worse by the day. Sooner or later, I'll have to decide who will be the next leader of the Siwa School of the Sidereals. I'm the best student he has. I'll carry on his legacy and become the true savior of Annika and the rest of the world. To prove that, I'll purge the evil cave. And then all of Annika will know what I'm capable of. Okay. So I guess we gotta get out of here. We have half an hour. Half an hour to find the other piece. We're also no closer to level 50 than when we started. <laughs> Um, which zone is it? It is. Twilight Mists? It is. I think it's in the Foul Hollow. Uh, yeah, we can't do any more research. Research is really expensive. Yeah, it's like, it's like almost 15,000 guild coins or guild whatever you know what i mean don't worry i'm on top of that shit don't worry okay we're gonna skip this we've done this before so i believe it's like up here is where the thing is Okay, whatever. Whatever, dude. We're just gonna walk through poison. We're just looking for a thing. It's fine. We're actually quite hurt. <laughs> Maybe me just saying, fuck it, walk through poison isn't the best idea. Who'd have thunk? I'm not trying to beat the dungeon. I'm just trying to get my shit. Okay, where is it? Where is it? Where is the second part of this story? It's somewhere over here. Dude, come on. Fuck it, you know what? Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. Where is this? Where is this hidden story? Oh, whatever. There it is. Said so here's two students. The master's wrong. I can't believe he chose that wimpy kid instead of me. Way instead of me. I've made sure the upcoming inheritance of Dochol fails by lacing his medicine with poison. If I can't be the one, then no one else can. No one. Okay. Let's get out of here. We got it.
Okay, that's all we wanted there. And bam! We're done the hidden stories of Annika. Okay. Now we just we need to do the we need to do a bunch of other shit. Okay, I'll kill this dude. Come on. Come on, guys. Okay, I think we can get out of Annika now. So. The question is... Is it best for us to go to Arthatine, or is it best for us to go to Vern? Uh... Okay, let's sail. Okay, oh, there's Arthatine. Yeah... Here's the thing, though. Once I hit 50... Okay, let's go up here. What is this? Sail through the hazardous waters. Oh, it wants me to go through. I don't... Do I have protection? I don't have sandstorm protection, I don't think. Oh, Turtle Island. We've been there. It'll be nice once I hit 50 to just be like, okay, now I can just explore wherever the hell I want. Wherever the hell I want. How are you liking Chaos Dungeons, by the way? Hmm. Oh, we have dispatch. Dispatch is complete. And also, have you been to any PvP persistent islands? I've noticed there's some islands where PvP is always on. With those, I would pull up a guide and be like, where are the Makokos? We're getting in and we're getting out. I would <laughs> fucking do those islands with my, uh, with my, uh, sharpshooter so I can just go invisible. Storm seas. There are numerous hazardous waters like this on the high seas. So we need to be careful. Yoink! Marine conservationist. What does that get you? Is that for picking up a uh, flotsam? We could have just gone around the sandstorm seas, but of course not. Of course we didn't. Okay. You got do you have anything? Secret map. Huh. Huh. Ooh. Okay, let's pop in. Repair. Sure. 
And we'll dock. I need to go to my stronghold real fast. My in I feel like I'm in Borderlands or something right now. We're in steampunk land. Rage. I still have yet to play Rage. I should play that on stream at some point. Okay, come on. Play the... Stop lagging. There we go. Yep, this is steampunk land. Okay. I mean, we could kind of tell for because uh, the dude who made those robots was from Arthatine. <laughs> the freaking I think one one what's his name? One arm, something like that. One hand, one hand was going to Arthatine to get another arm. You're back. I was waiting for you. There are matters that need your approval. Wait, what? You can go check them in the office. There we go. Mission start. Perfect. Action energy has depleted. Ah, we're fine. Stop worrying. Stop worrying. It's okay. So is this where we should start riding around on the robo dick mount? Who's this? Who are we talking to? Oh, okay. An NPC that wasn't there yet. Ooh, welcome. Welcome to Arthatine. Customs Clarence. Welcome to Arthatine. So, what's the purpose of your visit? What? You're looking for the Ark? The legendary Ark. <laughs> Another dreamer. Well, here at Arthatine, you can get your hands on any information you want. I'm sure that you can uh, find some tall tale about the Ark, Come to too. Think of it. A reporter from Stern wrote an article on the Ark some time ago. His name is Mattias. Why don't you go talk about him? Uh, why don't you go talk to him about it? Okay. What's up, Mattias? Patrol is all clear. Ah, right, here. Let's get the Triforce. Bam. Interested in a simple job? I've received... I've been receiving complaints about dirty, unreadable signboards, but I'm too busy to take care of them myself. Clean the signboards around the port and come back to me. I'll reward you handsomely. That seems like a, uh... A constant job here. Huh? You want, you want information about the Ark? You get right down to business, don't you? Well, I can give it to you, but only for a price. Nothing's for free in this world. You get me? But hey, since you're not exactly from around here, I'll be generous. Help me write an article, and I'll tell you what I know. What do you say? Sure. Great. It's really simple. First, I want you to ask the people around here what they think about the cancellation of the Verdantier. What's the Verdantier? Jeez, don't you know? It's a huge tower-like device that developed to turn this desert into a verdant paradise. Oh, verdant here? <laughs> As the apex of Arthatine's technology, that tower was supposed to stretch up to the sky. Can't believe you've never heard of it before. It was a major proje project at an unprecedented scale, so news of it was everywhere. Well, if you didn't know, now you do. But you'd better keep up with the news from now on. Okay, go ask around. We don't have all day. Troll is all clear. Troll is all clear. Troll is all clear. Draws all clear. I wonder what Nuria's doing. Come on. Come on, Kling. Why do you ask? Are you with that jerk of a reporter from Point News? No. I have nothing to say to you. Uh, 
This feels so different than the rest of the game thus far. There's no work to do now that the Verdant Tier construction got canceled. Verdant Tier. Verdant Tier construction got canceled. All clear. Looking for a job. What the hell is this dude? That dude jiggles. This place would be a hell on the eyes. Oh my god. No wonder there's the Arthurtine goggles. Who knew Treasurer Sasha would oppose technologist Krauss? But I understand why she did it. I never did like the idea of the Verdant here. The Verdant Tear can turn this desert into a lush paradise. Stopping its construction was the worst decision Bastion ever made. Hmm. I'm curious what the other continents are like, uh, tonally. You came back, thank you. I blame this problem on the sea winds. The desert sandstorms. I'd better talk to my management and hire some more people. I wish you weren't a foreigner. I would have loved to work with you. Oh. Okay. I need to get my skills up to like, uh, my virtues up to like 140, 150. I really need to get that happening. Oh. Everyone has something to say, huh? <laughs> I thought so. Everyone's suspicious. At the beginning of the construction, Administrator Bastion was fully supportive of Technologist Kraus. But then suddenly, just before the tower was set to be completed, Bastion put a halt to its construction. What's even more suspicious is that Treasurer Sasha took sides with the Administrator. Considering her relationship with te the Technologist, the odds were that she would support Kraus. Can this be a checks and balances type of thing? Ever since the Guard was formed, the Technologist has become more powerful. A titanic power struggle among the three leaders? <laughs> I can write one heck of an article with red meat like that. Good job. Now let's move on, shall we? Thought your job was done? <laughs> Are you joking? You didn't think the information you, you want is that cheap, did you? Now then, let's take this draft of my article to photographer Marx. He'll let you know what to do next. Uh, okay. What do you want from me? My name is Basilok. You look like a strong warrior. Which agency represents you? If you don't have one, maybe you should consider mine. Eckhorn Mercenary Office. My agency represents many famous mercenaries. Even regulators and local militias use our services. Let us represent you and you'll be swimming in jobs. Our clients pay better than most, too. So, would you like to sign a contract with us? Sure, I'll sign it. I'll take, I can take care of myself. I see how disappointing. I'd love to represent a strong person like you. Why don't you think my offer over? You're welcome in my office anytime. Fine. I don't trust contracts. Good. You made an excellent choice. You won't regret it. Here, take this. It's your contract. Sign here and we'll be a team. Mercenary agreement, Eckhorn office. Mercenary contract terms and conditions. Mercenary contract entered into and effective as of between office and mercenary. What? God, they're, they're doing the uh, the lawyer speak. Mercenary contract entered into and effective as of between office and mercenary. Contract period. This contract remains effective for an unlimited time unless a mercenary retires or expresses their wish to withdraw from the contract. Well, that seems easy. Brokerage commission. Office is entitled to 10% brokerage commission for every job it introduces to mercenary. Legal liability. Office only accepts jobs that comply with the law. Mercenary is prohibited from taking on illegal jobs in the name of the office. Personal favors excluded. 
Office and Mercenary here to have agreed that to these terms and conditions and executed the contract as acknowledged by the signatures below. Mint plant. Why, hello there. Did you sign it? Let me see. Great. Thank you for choosing Accord Mercenary Office. So I can just back out if I say I don't wish to be in the contract anymore. A while ago, the port guard arrested someone who had an illegal performance enhancing drug. It turned out that this banned product was released on the black market in massive quantities. My office found out that there's a group of suppliers for these drugs. According to my intel, they're making a trade today. Is this a uh, cyberpunk? At the market district on the east side of Lupin Port, we already know who these smugglers are. Head over there now. Follow them and identify uh, their base and distribution routes. This feels like a job in Cyberpunk 2077. Hmm. Let's listen to their conversation. Oh, I gotta move somewhere else. And guess where what is? What? Uh, sandstorms, blah, blah, blah. Wait. Oh, there it is. Move to a safe place. Where's the smuggler's base? Here? Okay, let's jump. Uh, move to a safe place. Disguise yourself as a smuggler. Say the password will disguise as a smuggler. Okay. I'm glad. Oh my gosh. That outfit. Hmm, how's the weather today? There will be sandstorms. You came. It must be tough working in such dry weather. Where's the merchandise? What? You don't have it yet? Urgh. This is why I told you to move your factory. I know, it's the only place that the port doesn't bother to look. But I told you, I can do this right under their noses. For now, get the merchandise. My customers are getting impatient. Just make sure to tell your boss to consider moving his facilities. <laughs> You're back. Did you learn anything useful? So there's an emerald ample, uh, ampule factory uh, where the port guard doesn't patrol. I think I know where it might be. There's an abandoned village east of Lupin Port. It was built to mine port, uh, pot and stones... And it closed down after the mine dried up. The smugglers must be based there. Good work locating their base so quickly. I'd better let the port guard know where it is, too. If you have time later, go see port guard Captain Kling. Smugglers like them are always bad news for guard, uh, for the guard. Now that we know where they are, it's time to round them up. Let's get a hold of the merchandise first. Infiltrate the base and steal their boxes of emerald ampules. I'll send a guy named Hearts out. To help you. Uh, he'll get you disguised as a smuggler. Okay. Roll. Where's Marks? He's up there. Use this elevator to leave the port. No worries. I got it.
<laughs> when you said have fun walking, I was like, there's no way. There's no way, Zulu. Hey, what's up? Are you Mint Plant? Let's get on with our mission, shall we? Before you arrived, I was about to uh, contact one of the smugglers. He'll tell us where they keep the Emerald Ampules in exchange for our help getting him out of that group. Wear these clothes and sneak into their base. The surly smuggler will be waiting for you. Nice. Oh, there's a guy I need to kill. It's fine. It's fine, guys. <clears throat> I'm one of you guys. Oh, look at these corpses. <laughs> Where did they come from? That's so crazy. <laughs> hey, guys. Oh, I was here all along. Hey, how's the wife doing? Oh. What took you so long? It's time for the shift change. We have to hurry. Take the elevator down and tell the unenthusiastic smuggler that I sent you. He'll tell you where... <laughs> tell the unenthusiastic smuggler. I'm like, hmm, which of these guys... That guy seems a little bit too excited about smuggling. It's not him. Oh, that guy. Uh, that I sent you. He'll tell you where the emerald ampule boxes are. Time for us to wait for an elevator. Why is my character giggling? My character's... Ah, ah, ah. Is only when it stands still, though? <laughs> yes. Let's go. Oh, I guess not. Unenthusiastic smuggler. Let's let's look at her. Yep, she is not enthusiastic at all. You're from the outside, aren't you? I can tell. I'm known for my good judgment skills around here. What? The irritable guy told you to talk to me? So you're from the mercenary office. He's really determined to get out of this life. I don't blame him. I want to quit too. Follow this passageway down and you'll see an iron door. The emerald ampules are stored on the other side of it. Thank you. You can't do trade skills. Oh, because last night I went to do my trade skills and my stronghold was empty. Every single thing in my stronghold was gone. So I was like, okay, I'm going to block my stronghold. <laughs> uh, Report to the mercenary office. <laughs> what do you mean? It's like <laughs> you did that as a joke. 
I did that as a joke. Yeah. Oh, you know that money that you went to buy a hamburger with, but you couldn't? You went to pay, and it wasn't there? I took the money as a joke. Yeah, you can buy hamburger, but it was a joke. Don't you get it? Uh, where are we going? All right, let's just get out of here. Yeah, yours, which is empty. Good work out there. I'll turn these emerald ampules over to the port guard right away. Also put in a good word with the guard for the two kidnappers who helped you. By the way, uh, did you learn where they got the recipe for this drug? Virtue Charisma. Ooh, we got a lot of charisma for that. Uh, nice. Okay. Oh, oh, we're so close to leveling. <laughs> Use this elevator to leave the port. I want to. I think my elk's about to get decapitated. Ah! Okay. Let's deliver Matthias's article to photographer Marks. This is his uh, news draft. It's finally here. Matthias, that jerk. Well, he's not completely amoral. At least he sent me some help. Okay. I'd like for you to go up the hill and take some photos. I've already set up a camera there. All you have to do is click the button. Hurry. Uh, which way? That way. I like how you can see all the guys in the distance. That's pretty cool. God dang. I feel like I'm <laughs> watching Final Fantasy 14 right now. Let's see. What? This is the mech corpse. That's strange. Where is it going? I thought that ever since the cancellation of the Verdantier's construction, the uh, mech corpse were disbanded. Guard Burkle is the one who is in, uh, in charge here. Go ask him if the order to disband the corpse was ever carried out. Come on. Was the disbandment order for the mech core carried out? Sorry, I don't have time to answer. Wait, you look pretty capable, adventurer. Uh, do you take on mercenary jobs by any chance? We've been warned by a mysterious extremist group that it would attack our trains. Wow, this is really Final Fantasy. The time they promised it would happen is getting closer, but we're not even close to identifying who made the threat. We need your help to find them. The northern outpost is the most desperate for help. Please report to Captain Schwager there. He'll tell you what to do. What happened? Were you able to confirm? What do you mean? That it's not important. Impending train attack? That sounds serious, right? What are you doing? You're helping them find the terrorists? Okay, go do that. I'll take care of the issue with the mech core. Level? Level 50! Ooh, a guild quest guide to carry out. Okay. Hmm... Let's see. What does this give us? 
Also, you change direction gives you more esoteric. That's cool. Damage to staggered foes. We'll do that for now. Slam foes down while airborne to inflict extra damage. Damage to pushed foes. Uh. Okay, we'll try that. There's a bunch of damage. Huh. Let's try this out. Um, and this is outgoing damage increases damage to staggered foes, leaves an after image to turn body semi transparent. I wonder how long that lasts. That's interesting. Okay, let's get these quests real fast. How'd you like to work with me on some potentially great research? Absolutely. I knew it. Of course you'd help me. I'm telling you, this could be a monumental, a monumental research project. You'd regret it if you missed out on this opportunity. Thank you for your cooperation. Sounds good. Arthatine is a city-state built on the desert. Nowhere except for Nebelhorn is capable of producing water on its own. This means that the country spends a lot of money on importing both drinking water, drinking and industrial water. I've come up with a genius idea to alleviate this problem. Wallow cacti live all across Arthatine. They release a sap when threatened. Their sap is slightly toxic. But I've also got a solution for that. I feel like there's an easier way. Please jump in front of a train? What, Zulu? Anyways. Oh, we're getting attacked. Their sap is slightly toxic, but I've got a solution for that. You want water from the living cacti? Yes. Where do you think all the water in the desert is? It's clearly in the cacti. Their sap is slightly toxic, but I've got a solution for it. I just don't know how much sap each cactus produces. Could you help me figure this out? Um, I don't think this makes a lot of sense, to be honest. Uh, you'll have... You'll... Uh, you'll have to travel pretty far for this research. Use the communication device to report to me. You can get permission to use it from Guard Jelrin at the Northern Guard Post. To fix TMAS, I need quartz crystals and scrap iron. Could you help me? This guy is my friend. He's uh, such an... But he's such an old model that he, re his replacement parts are not readily available. Everyone tells me to give him up. But I could never ever do that to him. Could you pl uh, please, would you be so kind as to help me? I'll help. Thank you for being so kind. You can find quartz crystals in the supply crates in the nearby base. As for scrap iron, you'll just have to fi fight the mecha sappers. TMAS is such an old model uh, that now the metal used in him can only be found in those things. Mm. Getting some parts from those sappers isn't illegal, is it? When you get all the necessary materials, please give them to my colleagues, researcher, my colleague, researcher Parnell. Chris Parnell? Okay, so we have some quests. Find my own port. Co-oping the sea. Adventurous Tome and Ignea. I can f Oh, God. Oh, my gosh. So, does one of these quests lead me to where I need to go? For the uh, thing? Or do we just head to Vern and find the thing there? Okay. Ready to sail. We are now level 50. Okay. Let's uh, set sail. North burn. Where is it? There? Okay. And I shall be right back. Let's hope I do not get killed on the way. Ha 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 ha. BRB.
And back. Okay. While we're at it, what are these quests all about? Oops. Okay. So, we need to learn about Ignea tokens. That's cool. <laughs> to learn about the Adventure Stone. You're waiting till level 50 for that. Uh, Port Krona's Tea and Libra Guild Vessel. Hmm. Interesting. Merchant stuff. Cooping the seas. Great ways to enjoy sailing. Cooperate with other captains to solve various problems. Cool. So that's co-op quest. And visit marina near Pletia. Or, uh... Oh, visit the marinas and obtain useful information. Okay. Lullaby Island. What is that? Oh, so there's all these, like, timed things. Huh... Oh, this is new. Oh, this is... Ooh! Wow, it tells you when all these guys spawn and stuff. That's pretty sick. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, proving grounds like I'm ever going to do that again. Get the F out of here. Okay. What? You're saying the, uh, bit frost that island? What? Uh, 14, 20. Oh, so it's in seven minutes. Whatever, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. Hello, goats. Hello, wild potatoes. Let's repair. Dog. Port Krona. So where is this? Where is this quest? Let's see. Una's tasks. That popping. That is some crazy popping. Okay, content of adventurers. Uh, Ark? What's that? A ship? An artifact? Hmm, Rowan is the expert when it comes to myths. He was a famous member of the Adventurers Guild back in the day. Judging by your reaction, you don't know what this Adventurers Guild is, do you? You should go ask him. Here, let's let's hide this. Let's hide this. We'll hide those. Also, while we're at it, Eshu's letter, Captain. Do you know about the marinas? They're the foothold for natives who settled and live at sea. They're very uh, closed places, but contain facilities to live well in the middle of the ocean. Most importantly, it's possible to dock there. It means you can repair your ship or charge your crew in the middle of the ocean. It's a shame that docking isn't allowed to all outsiders. First, you need to build a friendly relationship with each marina by supporting them with each necessary resource they need. The natives act based on practicality. So the more you support them, the more they will open their marinas to you. If you engage with the natives at a good location, you'll find you'll be easier. Bleh, you'll be able to easily enter docking mode. I prepared a suitable place. Let's go. Cool. Haberk's letter. Now you seem like uh, you seem more like a seasoned captain who can handle the sea. You'll now be able to participate in co-op quests that occur at sea. If we're talking about the sea, then it has to be co-op quests. How amazing is it to see all these great ships come together for one common goal in this vast ocean? I'll teach you how to participate in them. First, 
open the world map and see that there are co-op quests occurring. If there are none, then wait a little and they will appear. When the notification for a co-op quest appears, all you have to do is quickly sail to that location and participate. Co-op quests mainly occur in the hazardous waters. The, uh, the reward depends on how dangerous it is. Some ships are have more advantages in dangerous hazardous waters. You have to prepare meticulously before departing to be able to truly enjoy sailing activities. Make sure... Uh, also, make sure we don't end up in any shipwrecks. Cool. Uh, let's see. You're ordering groceries, you got a new alarm clock, and you have uh, been waking up on time entirely by luck. Dirty dog. Yeah. <laughs> Hello there. Huh? Rowan. Yeah, you can find him up there. Sounds good. I'm curious. Oh, so Vern is where they would take you after Arthatine anyways. Where are you running to? Oh, Rowan is up there. He's been telling stories uh, of his adventures to rookies all day. You ran all the you way up here like it was... Oh, here. here we go. <laughs> like it was nothing. You must train. So what's the rush? What? You want to know about the Ark in Vern? If it really is in Vern, I've never heard about it. But perhaps some other adventurers might know. You could go to Rania Village over on the other side. The Guildmaster's... Uh, the Guildmaster Gideon might know about it. To get to Rania Village, go up these stairs. Wait. What was that? I heard a strange sound coming from that way. I hear noises Rowan mentioned. Noise coming from the port. Oh. Did something happen at the port? Of course. Pride home all over again. The port. What happened here? Yes, it's, I did. It's on fire. Not sure what's going on, but this is our chance. We can make a fortune from this. <laughs> the subtitles pop up way later than the voice lines. Oh. Get to the port. Never seen anything like this before. It's we, okay, guys. I'm just about to board the ship. Okay. Bye guys. Go. Ow, I didn't make it to him. Okay. Go down the stairs at the port. Yes. I probably don't even need to kill any of these guys. What class did you say you're playing again, Wild Potatoes? No, oh, it's okay. She's just playing dead. It's fine. She's just wasted like usual. Stop staring and start picking up. Otherwise, get lost. Who's this? Oh no! The crabs have joined the fray! Not the crabs! Okay. 
Okay. Get out of here. What's up? Thank you. There are more inside. Please help them. Adventurer, the other villagers are in danger. Krobin protected me and didn't make it. Mm. Are you an adventurer as well? Please help. These men in black robes came out of nowhere and began reanimating the dead. All I could do was evacuate a few villagers. There are still people inside the port. They need help. I'll protect these children. Please join the other adventurers and help the people there. See you later, guys. What do we have to do now? <laughs> Defeat converging corpses. Okay. They dead. Okay. What now? Here, I'll help you out with that crab. God damn. Oh, well, I still hit him. It's fine. He's dead. Okay, we can ignore those dudes. Who cares? We can ignore those dudes. I'm like a true hero here. Two more necromancers. Goodbye. Oh my god, he exploded on the roof of the building. Okay, I'll kill these guys because it's fun and cool. I hate how often I miss with that attack. Come on. There we go. Thank you. So no worries, guys. Sorry I just exposed you to crabs. Oh, God. I had to give that call to so many people. <laughs> Thank you, Simon. Guys, so how I've missed the screams. Look at this guy just weirdly never levitating. So alive, Garum. Dark creature born of my own blood what? and soul. Is he supposed to be on the ground behind this dude? Herald my return with your roar. Looked weird as fuck. God damn it! I wasted my attack! Uh, what is that? That hurts. Ah. 
Okay. We've done like no damage to this dude. There we go. Oh God, what Simon? You, Sigmund, how are you here? You're dead. I watched you die. Chaos has seen fit to return me to the world of the living. And I would ask you the same thing, Thor. Did you get you a button that you press it and it plays it? So eager to resume our century-old battle. Patience, Garum. We need more time to prepare. Are you okay? That is amazing, Simon. Uh, tell me what... Is that... Is that Backstreet's Back? Is that the album it was on? I'm Thar, a knight. What's your name? That was Millennium? I didn't realize it was that late. Wow. I'm Thar, a knight. What's your name? Mint plant. I see. If it weren't for you, things could have gotten much worse. Many thanks. However, the only BS... Oh, really? I owned... Um... I forget what their first album... I don't know if it was their first album. But it was the one that was like, Get down, get down, and move it all around. Oh, baby, baby, the girl like you. This is a bad, the best bit that do. Ah. That one? I had that one. And then I had Backstreet's Back, which was, uh, yeah. And then I had uh, Millennium. I think I had those three. Was it, what was the one after Millennium? And that makes you larger than life. Anyways, there are still people who need to be evacuated. The demon beasts that suddenly appeared have inflicted mass casualties. Garum, the flame of, of, the, of that demon beast burn... <laughs> Why am I having so much trouble reading this right now? Garum, the flames of that demon beast burn from a vile magic. The wounds from that... Uh, burn. Do not heal easily. Take this pendant and treat the victims. Okay, where to? You know who I think got me out of Backstreet Boys was the Goo Goo Dolls. No. Those were my days of like of listening How to pop. This happen? Uh, what's going I on? thought there weren't any demons in Vern. Oh, thank the gods. Thank you so much. I came from Lutera. I feel from much chaos. better now. And this is what we get? The light. The light is gone. Is something bothering you? Maybe I'm impure. It's the only explanation I can think of why the light would disappear. This guy is like totally a, a Demon Souls character or something. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to surprise you. I fought Necromancer Sigmund before. Maybe I got cursed during the battle. We must alert the castle to Sigmund's resurrection. Let's get out of here now. Simon, when you were back, I have to tell you a, a tragic story that played out over last night and today. Finally, I've been waiting for you. Okay. Beautiful. Take that. Oh, yes. Yes, Zulu. Yes, it is. You just wait and see. Dismantle these two. <laughs> F me? Huh? You're going to talk to me like that? Okay, I'm not going to worry about the side quest right now. Head 
east through the forest and you'll see a castle. Uh, you may have just gotten over... Got the... Oh, okay, nice. Simon, are you ready for a story? Here, actually, let's leave because Zulu's probably going to want to chip in and insult me. Oh, Zulu. That seems uh, kind of unnecessary. Anyways, so last night, I'm like, okay, it's late. It is almost bedtime. I'm going to go to my island and do my gathering. Here, let, let's, let's step back earlier. So beforehand, I was like, oh, you know what? I will, I will keep the, you know, the permissions on my island so, you know, my friends can, you know, harvest if they need some stuff, right? The last night, I'm like, I'm going to go to bed. I'm really tired of a headache. Let me just, uh, let me just go and harvest on my island to use my stuff that I need, and then I'll go to bed. Go to my island. Literally every single thing was looted off my island. Every single one. Every single one. So I was like, hmm, that seems a little overkill. I wonder if Simon or Zulu did it. Oh, well. So I, I go check out Zulu's island. And literally everything is gone from his island, too. So I'm like, okay. Well, that kind of defeats the purpose. Uh, maybe I'm going to block off my stronghold so only I can loot it and we'll all just, you know, loot our own gatherables. So today, Zulu's like... Well, actually, I can probably find it in chat before he talks about me getting mouth banged. Uh, which was a weird thing to say. Uh, anyways, what does he say? He says, why are you stronghold things blocking me? I can't do trade skills. And I was like, yeah, Zulu. Uh, that's because everything was taken from my stronghold. And he says, I did that as a joke. I, was like, I don't think you understand the definition of a joke. If someone is like, hey... I'm gonna buy I'm gonna buy a burger. And I steal money from their wallet. And then they go to pay for the burger, like I don't have cash. It's like, yeah, I know I have it. Oh really? Well, you can't do that. That's not uh, I'm not giving you any more money. Hey, I did it as a joke. Well then give me the money back. I can't! But it was a joke! Zulu. Zulu. Okay, let's <laughs> let's continue. Head east through the forest and you'll see a castle. I want to go to Vern Castle, but now is not the right time for me. Please, don't tell anyone about me. Thank you. Those poor people. They must be so hungry. Uh, wait, what were you saying? Good thing you don't have any of that on your stronghold yet. Yeah, lock that shit down, Simon. Lock that shit down. What should you do? How do life skills work? Um, and how does one use up everything? Um, at this point, I don't think it's a really big deal, Wild Potatoes. What I will say is that it seems like the Stronghold upgrades use a lot of wood and a lot of stone. So early on, personally, I would focus on wood and stone more than the others because they seem the most beneficial for upgrading your Stronghold and uh, for crafting stuff. Uh, I'm sure that will shift over time. That's just my preference, but also, you know, Follow your heart. It's, it's worth focusing on everything. Getting those uh, getting those world tree leaves, which will bump up all your trade skills. Okay. Oh, I don't, I don't care about this quest right now. What are we doing? Pass through Chrono Forest to reach Avern Castle. We can do that. Level 50? What? You have half the Makokos? Oh, there's a Makoko here. Nice. GG. What is this? Dispatch is still in progress. Research is still in progress. You notice one thing about PvP, it connects all servers. It does connect Holy all servers. Yes, you're correct. Oh, you're a new face. What do you need? I fucking suck at the PvP, wild potatoes. I'm fucking terrible. 
I'm routinely in the bottom three and often in the bottom one. <laughs> Simon. Oh, I fucking hate it. The only thing I wish is that PvP and PvE benefits were separate, but eh. Oh, that, that's janky as fuck. What is that? Oh, there we go. Holy shit. What is going on with this game right now? Like, I wish PvP was more centered around getting, like, like skins and mounts and stuff like that. Rather than, like, roster-based bonuses and, like, that that are... Because PvP, the rewards you get are PvE rewards. Um, that aren't, like, cosmetic. They are, like, crafting recipes. Uh, title, like, stat, stat boosts. What is this? Oh, the festival starts in an hour. I'm so curious about what these festivals are. I think I got the day 15 login reward today. I'm pretty sure. Oh, we can bind our soul here if we want. Ooh, there's a quest here. Exchange Ignea tokens. There's another Nuria, it seems. Okay. Oh, let's get this. Halt. I have no this clue. This area is off limits to foreigners. Huh? <sighs> so you want to fight, huh? Your funeral. What's going on? Huh? That pendant. It's from an order of knights that was destroyed. It seems you owe me an explanation. Follow me. Ah, she sounded really, uh, upset with us. Okay. That pendant belongs to my old friend, Thar. Where did you get it? It's suspicious that you used it to enter my castle. Tell me everything, now. Uh, I can explain, but I must see the queen. You can't explain it to me? We'll see. As a knight of the Vern Castle, I must know why you want to see my regent. Tell me, or you're not going to see her. Necromancer Sigmund was resurrected. Sigmund? You mean Necromancer Sigmund from a hundred years ago? How do you know his name, outsider? You'd better elaborate on that. You saw him at Port Krona. You mean that incident? Oh, no. I don't want to believe it, but if what you're talking about is true, we're in trouble. Okay, you may receive an audience with Her Majesty. Go. Wow, Vern is a nice castle. I think Vern wins. Yep, research is done. So we'll probably use it next week. We'll use the bonus from that next week. That, she is pretty, um, what's the word? Uncanny Valley. Welcome. What brings you to me? I was told you insisted on seeing me. A monster showed up and burned down Port Krona. Elaborate now. Necromancer Sigmund has reappeared. <laughs> Impossible. He died a hundred years ago. But you don't look like you're lying. Adventurer, I must know who you are. Identify yourself. Let me introduce myself. 
Mint Plant, I've heard of you. You're the one who defeated the Regent at the Glorious Wall. Adventurer, I believe you. So, Sigmund the Necromancer has come back to life. Because of him, Vern was once covered in blood and darkness. I must deploy my knights at once. The Senators have gathered. I can discuss this matter with them right away. Could you tell the Speaker Alberto what you saw? Ooh, I just remembered something I have. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? We'll take that. Take that. Yoink. Wait, when you spawn under a giant corp spider because you forgot to put yourself in a safe... Oh, God. Oh, God. Ooh, I'll take those. Okay, what are these? I don't care about that right now. 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 Okay. I'm still using pretty, pretty outdated potions. Because why not? Okay. Uh, where are we headed? We were talking to someone in here. There they are. What do you mean? Sigmund has returned? No one's going to believe that. Ask the other senators here. Um, you know that one city just burnt down. Where's your proof? I've never heard of such a thing. Nonsense. He died a hundred years ago. Yeah, so were those dead people that came out of the ground and destroyed the town, you morons! It seems no one else in the Senate believes you. If you don't have definite proof, we senators can't consent to the deployment of the knights. How do you get definitive proof in a time before, like, you know what I mean? You're just like, yeah, I, uh, yeah, I literally, um, just saw the dead crawl out of the ground and kill everyone. Um, it's it, about five minute walk that way. What's the proof? You have no proof. Yeah, yeah, all those dead people that are now aren't dead and all the people that were alive that are now dead and then undead again. Where's the videotape? That technology has not been invented yet. We don't have definite proof. We senators can't consent to the deployment of the knights. Your majesty, you shouldn't consider deploying the knights simply because of what a single outsider told you. Not to mention, it would cost a lot of money that we can't afford. Sigmund died a hundred years ago. Even if he came back, he can't be more than a ghost. Too weak to even materialize himself. Where's your proof, Alberto? So please, make your decision wisely. We'll leave you to it now. Are you guys bought out by demons? As queen, I must respect the Senate's judgment. That means I can't deploy the knights. Uh, as a queen, it's your responsibility to look after your kingdom. Or queendom. The only thing, uh, the only other way I can think of is to hire an adventurer's guild and investigate this matter. But if Sigmund is, uh, has, really has resurrected, the guild can't handle him on its own. I've heard many great things about you. Could you assist the guild on my behalf? I'll help. Thank you. If Sigmund really has shown up in Vern, he has to have left evidence. I'll ask Knight Commander Avell um, to help you. Thank you in advance. Okay. We need to talk to a Knight Commander who is in the castle. How did you fare? What did Her Majesty say? The deployment of the knights fell through because of the Senate's objections. Or, uh, with the Adventurer's Guild instead of the knights. Uh... The Senators objected to their deployment. Those blockheaded coots, don't they understand the danger of Sigmund has come back? But in the end, it's Her Majesty's decision. I must obey her orders. I shall try my best to cooperate. You should speak with Rutaru, the person in charge of the Adventurer's Guild. Hey, Allo, how's it going? It has been a minute. How have you been? Here, I will make, I will log in and get that picture going right now. One second. A dumpling with a knife and an angry face, but cute, and maybe it has a wizard hat. 
You want me to word it exactly like that? Because I can do that. By the way, have you checked out this game? I'm curious. Uh, okay. Let's open the AI generated art thing. Log in. Log in. Create an image. A dumpling with a knife and an angry face, but cute. And maybe it has a wizard hat. Okay. Uh, and we will go advanced options. Wide screen. More iterations. Fuck it. We have enough. We'll do 800 iterations. Screw it. And while I'm at it, I will make another one. And this one will say... Cute, um, cute, angry, chibi dumpling with a knife. Is that, is that, let me, let me just see what you wrote. And wizard hat. Uh, and wizard hat. Let's try this one out. We'll also do the same number of iterations and we will come back to that. Uh, you've been playing a lot of scum and I, I actually think I saw you playing scum recently. I don't feel like I saw that. Maybe I saw that on my Steam friends list. I think that's where I saw it. Okay. You should speak with Rotaro, the person in charge of the Adventurers Guild. You'll find him in the military district of Vern Castle. My curiosity can wait until all of this is resolved. Stopping Sigmund should come before anything else. Let me know if you ever need my help. Okay. Military district is where? Over there. Let's just jump. Yeah, we've, uh, I think I've gotten Simon a bit. Uh, oh, okay. Head back here. I'm going to see. I will post the images in, uh, in Discord. They are only like 19% done. So you will see them in Discord. Nice seeing you. Take care. Hope you have a great day. We will protect this place. Gods. Hmm? How may I help you? Oh, I got you hooked on this game, Simon. Along with others. Where's the Adventurer's Guild leader? Oh, Rutaru? He ran towards the raid bulletin board, saying that he's got an urgent request. I don't know what request can be more urgent than those from the Magic Society. Wait, you look pretty strong. How'd you like to take up the challenge of the Chaos Dungeon? The Chaos Dungeon? Yeah, see that statue over there? It was built by the Earth God Arcturus a long time ago, as a ward against the Rift. But recently, the mortal world trembled, um, generated distorted after images of the Rift, and weakened the protective power of the statue. The Magic Society discovered... That one can stabilize its power by destroying these warped afterimages, also known as Chaos Dungeons. But one has to be pretty strong to resist the forces lurking on the other side of the rift. Uh, you look pretty strong. How can I try the Chaos Dungeons? So now I see that you've grown interested. You can enter the Chaos Dungeons through the Warrior of the Land statue. Now, take this Dimensional Resonance Stone. The stone resonates with the waves coming from the Dimensional Rift. Stand in front of the statue and use the stone to match the wavelength between you and the statue. Each time you stabilize the Dimensional Rift... Your achievements will be recorded on the Warrior of the Land statue. Those records will be incredibly useful one day in sealing the Dimensional Rift for good. Uh, now I'll activate the Warrior of Land statue for you. Mm. Hmm. 30% HP, that's fine. go let's equip that there uh you need to stay off twitter oh god <laughs> i have no idea what is going on but i will take your word for it for sure okay f5 to visit beatrice in trixion Wait, why do we need the Awakening Song? What? Why do we need to go to Trixion? What? 
Ah, it appears the resonance was successful. I mean, it's Florida, you know? <laughs> there is that. It appears the resonance was successful. The day will come when we'll be able to close down the dimensional rift completely. Until then, please keep working to restore peace in Arkesia. The new dimensional rift is open. Trixian needs a new source of power. Please, come help. Okay. Have a new quest. Speak with Safets. Except. Uh, we need to speak with Una. Uh, or Una's agent, Rutaru. That seems important. That seems like this might be the quest that we need. Yeah, isn't Florida like the number one punchline in every, like, American state joke? Huh. I'm the one in charge of the Adventurer's Guild in Vern Castle. How may I help you? Huh? You want to hire us on Her Majesty's behalf? Oh, sure. Let's go talk to our my guildmaster, Gideon. He's in Rania Village. He's been so anxious to recruit more members. He'll be excited to see you. By the way, you look like you've never been in Vern before. Have you even started Una's tasks? Una's tasks? Yes, the guilds in Vern support adventurers through Una's tasks, which range from monster raids to relief activities all over Arkesia. You can check the list of available requests by selecting Una's tasks on the bottom menu, which uh, basically you can perform three tasks a day. The Una's task list also includes personal requests based on your rapport in addition to the general ones from the guild, so check it regularly. Uh, there are three guilds that offer Una's tasks. Which guild do you want to get yours from? What what does this decision mean? Does this mean anything? I guess we'll go adventurers. Ignea is the adventurers guild, with Gideon as its leader. It usually offers discovery adventure and monster raid adventures. Don't you want to know about the other guilds? You don't have to commit yourself to a single guild. Okay, uh, quit. I want to see what the others are. You have the good work performing Una's task, but like I told you, you can only perform... Uh, do you remember how many tasks I said you can perform in a day? Three. Correct. You paid attention. That's right. You can only perform three tasks a day. Oops. I'm sorry if I took up too much time. Uh, are you going to go to Rania Village now, huh? You're meeting someone in Nuria's Tavern. Uh, then the fastest way to get there is using the floating stone next to me. I look forward to hearing great things about you, hero in waiting. <sighs> Um, I don't, technique. I don't have the Forest Minuet song, but based on what Zulu said, I think you unlock it after you get sailing from Lullaby Island. So, it'll be, it'll be after you leave your place. If you're level 34, though, you're probably getting relatively close to leaving the island. Uh, can I talk to that dude? Wait, what is this? Boss Rush? Nah, no thanks. Okay. I wanna fight a guardian. We have to head down here. Oh, I hear they cook your Okay. I was just looking for you. Judging by the look on your face, your meeting with the Adventurers Guild must have gone well. So, are you going to Rania Village now? On your way there, could you deliver these written orders to my men in Vern's, in Vern Castle's crafting district and in the Corona Forest? They'll help you with your investigation. By the way, there's something I wanted to ask you before you go. That pendant, where'd you get it? Actually, who gave it to you? I just picked it up somewhere. Liar. But you're not going to tell me, are you? Oh, well, I can be patient. But I've got to tell you. That pendant is too valuable to be left broken. You should get it fixed and make good use of it. Lucky for you, the Magic Society is right here in Vern Castle. I'll return to I'll return it to you once it's repaired. Consider that way that my way of paying you back for your help with the investigation. What? What's that look for? You don't trust me. I'm the commander of the Vern Castle Knights. I give you my word and I will return it to you. And I will. So finish the investigation and come back in one piece. You are so uh there's a lot of roster quests to do right now. But we want to go to I would go out on a date Oh, okay, we got to run over there. Okay. 
Havel's gotta be a rapport person, right? Havel seems pretty cool. Amazing magic. 35 minutes until the festival starts? Um, what should I have for dinner? What is this quest? That is absolutely exquisite. Merchants know how Greetings, adventurer. Uh, travel continents with the ocean liner. Oh, that one's easy. Have you perhaps visited another continent? Of course, you can navigate it on a ship yourself. Uh, you're always says 18 or 20 hours. Yeah, always just miss it. Uh, people say Paladin is pretty slow, um, but he's not bad and has plenty of AOE to make 30. I I've seen videos of high level Paladins just like one shotting um, like bosses. Uh, but using an ocean liner will only cost a few silver and is very fast and convenient. I'd like to know how to use it. My, my, it seems he didn't know. Then I'll tell you how to use the ocean liner. Uh, yeah, 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 whatever. Whatever, it's fine. The ocean liner helps you travel to a port you've visited before immediately. If it's a port you've used before, you can use the ocean liner agent Rift. Can I go wherever I want? Most of the time, but some ports require certain conditions. For example... Uh, there are the Rohindel and South Vern ports. You can only visit them after completing quests related to the unlocking the port. You can also travel to special islands where an event is held, um, and there are continents which aren't connected according to the port's location. Just keep that in mind. Wait, so can we go to special event islands like Lullaby Island using the ocean liner? There are continents which aren't connected um, according to the port's location. You keep that in mind. What do I do when I want to get off? When you want to get off, you can do so through Riff. But the silver you paid to get on the ocean liner isn't returned, so I advise you stay on board if you're not filthy rich. I believe I've told you everything about using an ocean liner. How about you go try it for yourself? Go look for o ocean liner agent Riff at the port. Cool. Let's get this. Let's talk to this person. Uh, there what they are. It? An order from Commander Avell. Let me check it right away. Hmm, I see. She wants me to give you any information I find about the Necromancer, no matter how insignificant it seems, Mint Plant. I'll do as she ordered. Okay. Now we're going up there. Easy peasy. I want to get these Una's tasks already. Pardon? Commander Avell's orders? Hmm, let's see. Hmm, got it. Okay, if I get any information about the Necromancer while on patrol, then I'll let you know through the Adventurer's Guild, Mint Plant. That's good. Where to? Uh, we have not been here. Is this up north? It is. Just getting started. Okay. How much experience does this take now? 43 million XP to level up. Yeah, I've heard that the uh, the grind once you get level 50. Level 50 is the soft cap. I think hard cap is level and 60. And it just slows down a fuck ton. I can provide you with Am I just going to let that girl get mugged? Okay, I guess so. This rainy village. Oh, Vista. Fine by me. Oh, that's pretty cool. Skills, I could get famous in no this reminds me of Guild Wars 2 for some reason. Yeah, I've heard it. I've heard once you get level 50, the gap from 50 to 60 is like months. This Rania village, home of the adventurers. Welcome to Rania, the village of adventurers. Need any help? The Adventurers Guild. Follow the road until you see the stairs on the left-hand side. The Adventurers Guild is at the top of the stairs. I mean, hey, we're already like what? 
you know, 180th, 180-something, 80th of the way there. We got this. An adventurer? Didn't expect to see you here. How did it go at Vern Castle? I see. Thank you for helping his, uh, her majesty. You made a difficult decision. I can't let you go alone. I hope you don't mind me taking along. The Adventurer's Guild is in charge of the security of this land. Let's pay it a visit together. How about this for a guild? Hmm? What do you want, stranger? We're here to see the Guildmaster. On orders of Her Majesty the Queen. <laughs> That's so, Tin Can Man. Really? An order from the Queen? You think you can just waltz in here and make up a story about... <laughs> Destroyed. Apparently, I can just waltz in here. Get him! Anyone else want to give it a shot? I can do this all day. Hold it, hold it! That's enough! I'm Gideon, the Guildmaster. Let's talk. Okay. Where are you, Gideon? Over here. Ah, I heard you helped my guild members at Port Krona. I'm sorry if they were rude to you. They just didn't know who you were. They're also irritated by the recent increase in riffraff who want to join our guild. Hey, adventurer, I've heard you were from Vern Castle. Does that mean those nobles are interested in us now? You're just an advance party, right? When are the others going to arrive? The two of us are all you're going to get. Just the two of you, are you kidding me? They sentenced us to death. I've got it. You must have fallen out of favor with your superiors, hmm? So, they sent you here to die among us lowly people. I pity you. We in the Adventurer's Guild will take things from here. You just step aside. We don't want to be held liable in case you get yourselves killed in a Balancar. Just stay back and watch. Since you helped our mates at Port Krona, we'll protect you. Capture the beast? No way. It's Garum you're talking about. It wiped out an entire group of the Queen's Knights before it went down the, lo uh, down the last time. And now she sent Mintplant here on her behalf. Isn't that right, Mintplant? You're just a guildmaster. How dare you defy the Queen's orders? You can't handle that demonic beast. <laughs> Quite confident, old man. But do you even know where that beast flew to? The Balancar Mountains. Queen's orders. I would never defy my Queen's orders. But I've never received any official letters. Why should I believe you? If you really want to catch the demon beast, then increase your standing here while we gather support. Come, join our guild, and you can earn your right to fight it. Just ask Annabelle about how to increase your standing. Make sure you... Okay, where is Annabelle? Okay. Hey... <laughs> Welcome to the Adventurer's Guild. I'm Annabelle, the Guild's clerk. If you'd like to join the Guild, please read the contract and sign at the bottom. Right now, our Guildmates are spread thin because of the Demon Beast. As the newest member, you'll be picking up their slack. Okay. Please sign the paper and submit it to the Guild clerk. The undersigned adventurer, adventurer, registering for the Rania Village Guild, the Guild, shall in good faith carry out the tasks requested by the Guild. The Guild shall compensate the adventurer for completed tasks and shall uh, indemnify the adventurer for any losses incurred through the course of completing the task, provided that such losses are not due to the negligence of the adventurer. The adventurer shall have the right to decline tasks deemed excessively risky or dangerous, but the adventurer is also responsible for any claims, damages, losses, expenses, costs, or liabilities whatsoever resulting or arising directly or indirectly from their decision. The guild cannot be held liable for any damages or losses the adventurer might sustain by accepting excessively dangerous tasks, and the adventurer uh, 
will be held liable for all financial and material damages and losses caused by their failure to complete their task. I have read the and agreed to the above terms and conditions. That it does not seem like the best contract for us. Mm, I've got your signature. Let me assign you a job. Complete those tasks and you'll be promoted from recruit to a regular member. If you want to go to Balancar, then you might want to increase your rank twice more from there. While you work, I'll gather information about the demon beast for you. I saw the job list. <sighs> They're going to make me wash dishes. After that, it's potato peeling and toilet cleaning. Ugh. I've never stooped to such work before. As a warrior, why should I per perform such inappropriate... Well, perhaps times have changed. All right, I'll accept them as part of my training. You do what you want to do. I'll do mine and we'll increase our ranks. Okay, listen. Uh, what do we have to do? Oh, that guy turned into that form. We can do that too. An adventurer? I should follow Simon around while I'm in that form. Those hungry refugees won't attack us, will they? How about a drink infused with the cool breeze of Shusha? Hmm. Wait, what are we doing here? Oh, I'm in the wrong building. This is terrible. With the port destroyed, I, I can't bring in goods to sell. Worse yet, they're giving out supplies for free. I'll go out of business like this. The guild probably loves this opportunity to brag, but merchants like us are screwed. Okay, I'm going to do something real fast. BRB. Okay, I am back. I'm done for. All the paintings at Port Krona have been burnt to a crisp. I just made a big investment on Pletch's greatest artworks, too. Now I'm practically broke. Oh, we've seen Pletch, yeah? You, are you from the Adventurers Guild? I've got something to ask you. I heard a lot of refugees will be swarming here soon, but... Who knows what kind of people that will bring. It's quite frightening. We need a guard or something. Maybe you should stand guard for us, hmm? My food to go with your goods are being rationed. This is horrible. If I can't sell off everything I've cooked as soon as possible, I'll go out of business. So... I think Un apparently Una's tasks are what allow me to do the guild weeklies, I believe. Look at those adventurers. An adventurer? Hmm. So that'll be nice to be able to start actually doing those things. You're here. Your attendance is noted. I'll be upgrading your rank on my list here then. Uh, you can now carry out missions as an official guildmate. Now that you've reached the appropriate rank, I can tell you about the Demon Beast. 
Currently, the guild believes that the demon beast is active somewhere within North Vern. According to witnesses, the beast's trail leads toward the Balancar Mountains. However, due to the awakening of Guardian Vergaris, the path toward Balancar Mountains is closed to outsiders. In order to access the Balancar Mountains, you'll need to attain a higher adventurer rank, recognized by the guild. Okay, let's speak with Gideon. Make sure you bring it this time. Oh, ah, well, that was fast. I expect big things from you. I've done some poking around while you were gone. It looks like the demon beasts aren't the only ones causing a ruckus. The necromancers have been busy, being a pains in the butt for everyone else, too. If you still want to go to Balancar, start by sorting things out at Fesner Highland. It's a relatively secluded highland that's frequented by peddlers, which ex unexpectedly became infested with ghosts. I can smell those rotten necromancers from all the way over here. Things at Fesnar seem a bit more urgent than they are in other regions, so if you manage to take care of things over there, I'll raise your rank right away. I've heard enough. Okay, now choose what kind of requests you want to take on. You can check all available requests for all different regions on the bulletin board, so make sure you check on all the posters. But I'll have you know, unless you settle things at Fesnar Highland, you and your friend over there won't be able won't get any work near Balancar, you hear me? Did you get qualified? I did too. Despite some challenges along the way. You need to raise your rank to get to the Balancar Mountains? All that work just to be granted passage. The world certainly has changed. Well, I guess I'll see you at Fesnar Highland. Okay. We got a request from the Skymus Trade Company. Recently, ghosts started attacking their members on Fesnar Highland. As a member of the Adventurers Guild, please go to Fesnar Highland and help them. Uh, okay. Are we eligible to do the tasks now? Make sure you bring it this time. Or not yet. Wee oui, wee. Oui. An adventurer? How could they insult those poor wretches? We're short on. I'm so. How many zones are in this place? Not that many. There's actually a lot of the world. A lot more of the world than I realized was in um, the first couple areas. See? There are ghosts Most... everywhere. Hey, are you from the Adventurer's Guild? You are, aren't you? Please say yes. Ghosts, some ghosts are rampaging right now. Some of my allies are still in the Highland. Please help. And if you can, please look for Vice President Hadnell. He's never been here before, but I'm worried he might have run towards the deepest part of the Highland. I'll worry about side quests another time. It's okay. Do I need to kill these guys? Oh, we just gotta loot this stuff. I see. Dude. There we go. Fesner, the merchants were raided. Got it. I say we split up and look for them. You know what? Fuck it. Fuck it. Overkill time. The merchants were raided. Got it. I say we split up and look for them. Do you know anything about this highland? This is where we fought the final battle between Necromancer Sigmund and Neverns Knights a hundred years ago. I could I couldn't ignore it when I heard this historic place was haunted by ghosts. First, let's plan our search. I'll cross the uh, viaduct and check the west side. You check east.
Ooh, this area is kind of cool. That was terrifying. Come on. Thank you. There we go. These guys have a lot more defense than the other guys we've been fighting. Okay. Uh, what do we have to do? Defeat ghost threatening merchants. Okay. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, talk to the dying warrior. Okay, whatever. They can deal with that. God damn it. Are we getting attacked? Shit. What happened? The ghost attacked. The vice president and his entourage. Sir Hadnil crossed the viaduct to the center of the highland. Those... spirits. Who's this Thar? Who... Oh. Go! I shall never forgive you. It is your fault I am like this. I curse you forevermore. Examine the dead Why? merchant. Why did you abandon us? Do we mean nothing to you? There we go. Is that a paladin? That was pretty cool. Okay. This area looks amazing. Holy shit. More spirits keep coming. Did you find that merchant, Hadnil? If he headed for the center of the highland, he might be in danger. Hurry. You did something to anger the ghosts. The ghosts are angry at me? Why? No. Finding that merchant, Hadnil, is our priority. Let's keep looking. What? Uh, XP to level up. Somebody help! Uh, I'm so scared. I was so scared here alone. The president is looking for me? Is Sir Baron alive? All hope is not lost. Thank the gods. Thank you for saving me. You're not part of my company, but you still didn't hesitate to help me. Are you friends with the knight in white armor who saved me a while ago? A knight in white armor? Yes, I was attacked by ghosts and he saved me. I would have died if it weren't for him. He took care of the ghosts and left without saying a word. I saw him heading for the center of the highlands. Wee, wee. my aid we fought together in the final battle against Sigmund until the end now it's time I tell you a hundred years ago I commanded the Knights of Vern we fought necromancer Sigmund and the demon beast Garam and, and all died here 
Or so I thought until I found myself alive again. Perhaps Turnark knows the truth behind what happened. One hundred years ago, my knights fought Necromancer Sigmund on this very highland. We managed to defeat his minion Garum, but killed ourselves in the, prog in the process. That was the last thing I remember. And then I opened my eyes and I was standing on the highland again, surrounded by ghosts. I realized all this has to do with necromancy. If Sigmund has resurrected, his necromancers must be somewhere on this highland. We must stop them. I can search the west side of the highland. I'll take the commander there with me. Could you check out the triport? It'll be easier uh, to search uh, the highland if we secure the triforce. Why don't we look around? Okay, Triforce. Bam. Let's go to the repair person. Okay. Beat oncoming night dudes. Gather up. Go. You're hey, what's up? Adventurer. Could you help me? Is this connected to that frog I found burning with a ring? A talking frog? Unimportant. Have some tact. Can't you just say, dear frog, how may I help you? Anyway, if you want to resolve the situation, follow the frogs to me. And the energy in the air here is murky. It needs purification. Take this to fix it. The frog spit something out. Throw that splendid orb at the necromancy pentacle to destroy it. The pentacle must not be left there. The necromantic energy encroaches on souls, rotting and corrupting them beyond salvation. Anyway, once you're done, please return the orb to me. Uh. Good luck finding it. Yay. There's five out of six. Dang it. Hey, what's up, talking frog? You're doing well. There we go. Fuck it, I'll kill these dudes. Talking frog. You will find me past the waterfall at the bottom of the cliff. I'll be waiting. Okay. I am Hoken Truba, a senior magic scholar of Vern. A hundred years ago, I fought Sigmund under Commander Thar's leadership. I've employed these frogs to bring you all the way here. You met Turnark? How is he doing? He's as lucky as ever. Turnark is right. The necromancers are reanimating the spirits of the knights to make us do their bidding. I looked around through the eyes of the frogs and saw the necromancers are in the center of the highland. So, hmm, what are you waiting for? I just gave you the enemy's location. Go to the center of the highland and wipe them out. Okay, we'll skip that quest for now. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Gather up. Gather up. Last one. Come on. Dead. Destroy soul resonance stones and defeat a high-ranking necromancer. Should have probably saved that for the high-ranking guy. Whatever. Who cares?
you dead. Okay. Oh, we need to destroy more of these stones. Okay, speak with Hoken Truba. Oh my gosh. Wow, that guy did some damage. Holy shit. There we go. Excellent. The necromantic energy in the air feels weaker. But taking care of them doesn't solve everything. The last battlefield where we fought, the place is now called the Tomb of Swords. Uh, called the Tomb of Swords is important. Necromancers place necro stones all over the place to keep their souls bound to them. Destroy them, and the spirits of the knights will be released from their grasp. Commander headed to the Tomb of Swords? I had better hurry. Please, tell the commander I'd like to see him. I once dabbled in necromancy. That's why I was able to escape its influence. But that's not the case with those two. There must be a reason. I want to see Commander Thar and Turnark in person. Perhaps they have some clues as to how to resist necromancy. Oh, Vista. Stark. I defeated any necromancers I found on the highland. Nothing's changed. Is it impossible to save my troops? You met Hoken Truba. That's great. The necrostones, if that's true, thank you. We can speed things up now. I'm going to take Turnark to Hoken Truba. If you can find more necrostones, please take care of them. Let those poor souls rest in peace. Uh, feet controlled knights, blah blah blah. Okay, sounds good. Ow. Go, come on, dude. Oh, we need to defeat seven more. Okay, hey guys. Okay, we need to defeat four more. Right, two more. Come on, there we go. There we go, we're done. And gotta head up north. All right. Defeat some scout guy, scout mage and centurion. Is that, that's the scout. Okay, he dead. Come on. 
He dead. And he dead. Okay. And we gotta speak with someone. Is it up north? He is. You destroyed the necro stones. Very good. But so long as the necro, uh, necromancy core remains, the spirits of the knights can't be freed. Sigmund must have used the Navigal's spirit for the core. Talk to the knights over there. They can tell you. I'm having a hard time maintaining my sanity, which means the core is growing stronger. He must be stopped at all costs. Godspeed. Uh, is there something you want to say? Don't tell this to the commander. But it's true that Turnark and the other knights were resurrected by Sigmund's necromancy. But the commander, it's different for him. I don't know... Exactly what? I can sense a different energy. Though faintly, just keep this to yourself for now. I heard Navikal's voice. I couldn't resist. He said I should hate Thar. The closer we get, the stronger this foul energy. I don't think I could resist this energy if I get any closer. I can't imagine how much pain Navigal must be in. Please save him. Uh, okay. I had better hurry. Come with me. I'm going to bring Navigal, uh, peace back to Navigal, and then rest the rest of my troops no matter what. Okay, we got an instance. I will be right back. See you guys in a sec. Okay, we are back. Let me check something real fast. Okay. Let's roll. Has it been a hundred years? To me... Everything's as vivid as it was just yesterday. The soldier screams, followed by the demon beast's roar. Even in such a hopeless situation, Navigal trusted me and fought till the end. And I can't even grant him peace after death. <laughs> We're two thirds done, basically. Can't move. Bam.
What are we at percentage wise? We're almost done. And dead. Okay. Uh, destroy the bad necrostone. This guy's intense. Now they go. Be careful. Yep, keep tanking the- oh! Jump! Holy shit! Ow. There we go. Sweet reunion. It seems like my will could not overcome the evil energy. The mastermind behind all this, Sigmund, is in Balancar Mountains. It seems like we left some loose ends back in our old lives. I know. This time, we'll finish it. I wish I could join you in that adventure, Sir Thar. Naviko. No regrets. It was an honor to have fought by your side. Let's get to Balancar Mountains. Okay, let's go. Excuse me, Thar, please appear. Here we go. Turnark. I see Navigal disappeared with everyone else. Strange, why am I still here? Well, our mission on this highland is completed. Let's return to the guild. Okay. Am I not disappearing? We'll turn in that quest real fast. Have you seen that? Oh, that How dude's still chilling there. Cycle? What the hell? Make sure you bring it this time. Hey, rookie. I heard you took on the spirits. How was it? You killed them all, didn't you? Wait, when you think about it, they're already dead. <laughs> anyway, uh, the Skymist merchants are finally able to take a breather thanks to you. And now we have the Triport. It'll be much easier for us to manage. <laughs> Who knew our rookie would become such a big time veteran? I'll admit. It didn't quite, uh, I didn't quite like the look in your eyes when I first saw you, but you're turning out to be quite a, a pretty useful guildmate. I bet even that friend of yours got some dirt on his shoddy armor, didn't he? All right, I'll raise your rank as promised. Go see Valoa and she'll give you an access pass to Balancar. Now, go to Balancar and give that demon beast what for. It won't be easy, though. Don't say I didn't warn you. Okay, well, I'm going to call it there for now. Um, thanks for joining me on this uh this brief stream it's been a pleasure take care everyone and i hope you guys have a wonderful evening Mwah.